gosh, remember last year? The Reavers stage an epic comeback and stun Indian Hills. Iowa Western heads back to nationals where Big Blue finishes fifth. So here we go again. And once again, the Reavers are home as Iowa Western hosts the District J tournament. Now it starts with some trailblazers, but I got a feeling it's gonna end with the Warriors. Third rank Iowa Western starts things off with Vincennes. All Reavers from the get-go, look out, one of four aces, 11 to six, Big Blue. How about a block party, 20 to 10. The Blazers, a little overmatched, as Iowa Western takes the first set, all fall down, 25-11. Second set, Caitlin Cooper drops one in, 17-11 home team, Imelda Aziabu, a good match. The sophomore from France, eight kills, as the Reavers just block Vincennes, winning the second set, 25-12. Alicia Williams reminds the team to not give any points away. Third set, more of the same. Caitlin Cooper leads the way with 10 kills overall. Kaylee Grant gets in the act, just yep, put a roof on it. 21-9 Iowa Western. The Reavers take the set and match 25-14. Yeah, we played well. We did some things really well. We played defense. We we passed. Uh, we worked in some kinks here and there. We got some playing time to everybody, so it was good to just uh, get relaxed for this this tournament. I think the team played really well. You need to improve some things for the next match, but this game it was good to be the team confident for play against Angel Hill. We play pretty good today, and I think we need to be. We need to try to play good to be ready for to play against Indian Hills. I hope. Iowa Western wins round one of the district tournament, but as you just heard, the Reavers still have some hills to climb. And for more on that, here's IDF TV student jumps right in, Riley Martin. Yay!